questions are that exactly what we put to the family coming up. But before we do, I want you to take a look at the Berlin again, and we have this video, this home video, because we think of the basket. In fact, it's that neck at the bottom of the balloon, which apparently has a little door inside it. And you'll want to know that as we talk to the family they gathered this morning, Richard, Mayumi, Falcon, brothers Bradford and Rio. Good morning to all of you. Uh, so Richard, this morning, what are you saying among yourselves about this whole event? Um, well, it's funny you asked that. Just, just seconds ago, I was my wife this feels like I'm still in bed and I'm dreaming this right here. This is probably because I'm still tired. I haven't really slept. <laughs> but um, we're so happy uh, that nothing uh, tragic uh, happened to uh, Falcon. And Falcon, how do you feel this morning? I feel good so far. <laughs> so far, can't be too careful. <laughs> All right, I, I just have to start by asking the questions because you know the message boards are lit up this morning with skeptics. We have the videotape that you gave us and I want to take a look at this moment again. Who, who's taking the footage here? <sighs> Uh, that was uh, Bradford. And I don't see a basket on the bottom of the balloon there. There was no basket? Um, well, yeah, there was a carriage there um, to hold the equipment. You seem to be angry. Mom. Shh, hold on. Um, well, yeah. Um, Miami, I'm sorry for yelling at you, by the way. I, 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 had, uh, I my Amy said she had tied the tethers down. So, you know, you know we expect everything uh, to go as planned. So uh, we hit the release pin and it, it elevated. And I think it did catch because it kind of shifted uh, at the 20 foot mark. And maybe it uh, had enough uh, force to pull itself out. You don't know. But I was very upset because I thought that she did not uh, tie him down. But uh, obviously the tethers were there. And um, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure what happened, quite mm -hmm. frankly. Okay, I'm gonna after our after we do our interview, I'm gonna ask uh, them to show you this footage so you can help explain to us what that basket is and where it is because we can't see it. But Brad, yeah. First of all, good morning to you, and I know it's very early for you, but tell me what mm -hmm. you think you saw. What were you worried you had seen with Falcon? Um, that. Falky went in a flying saucer and that he may get electrocuted. And I breathe. And did you see this? Uh uh. I just saw him I just saw him go under the flying saucer. But your dad and mom were there too, right? I don't know where they were. No, we were actually taking a break at the time, and Bradford opted to uh, stay out on the deck, and uh, he was shoot, shooting video. Why did you think Falcon might be in the balloon? Um, that's, um, I saw him go under it, and I saw the door shut. So he might have gotten in it and got right back out. Last night on Larry King Live, I'm going to pay this, play this moment for everyone, because there was kind of a gasp from people watching. Why didn't you come out? Um, you guys said that um, we did this for the show. Man. You had said we did this for a show? What it was was I asked him after last night's interview what he was talking about. And um, there were a lot of cameras out front of our, in front of our yard. And we were, of course, uh, getting interviewed. Falcon? Hmm? You okay there? You okay there? Hmm? You sure? He's uh, extremely <laughs> tired. Quite awake. No, Mom, I feel like I'm going to vomit. Oh. Mm. You okay, buddy? Mm. Uh, oh. Yeah, he's, I think he's queasy. Um, Should, should, we, should we take you to the bathroom or something? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool. Good buddy. Yeah. Uh, there's some. There's a wire here on your hand. 
Is he okay? Is somebody going to go with him? Mayomi, do you want to run with him? That's okay. We'll Is understand. That okay? Sure. Okay. We understand. Thank you. Is he okay, Richard? Let's see. Um, well, he's got asthma, and um, sometimes when he starts to get an attack, he feels queasy. Oh. Maybe that's what's going on. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's not sounding good in there. Yeah. It's not sounding good. It's mommy. Well, let me just ask a couple of questions. Uh, Brad, Brad and Rio, did you also think it was for a show? No. No, you no. were, were you scared? That, wait, like, when Dracula went up in the saucer or? Yes. Yeah, we're really scared. And did you know that Falcon sometimes hid up in the attic of the garage, Brad? No. I didn't even know he could go up there. Hmm. And then um, he, when, he sh when he showed the camera people, he actually went up there. Oh, he yeah, did? Yeah, that was kind of news to us. Yeah. Yeah, we had no idea that he had a secret hiding place. Um, are you okay? Are you okay, Saggy? I three times. Oh, man, I heard you in there. Yeah. I'm sorry, what was that question? Brad. What did you see when you looked at that videotape? What was in your, what was in your mind? Um, I, I felt uh, extremely weak and um, just overwhelmed. And to the people who have been emailing us, and there are a lot of them saying things like, this story has publicity stunt written all over it. What are you saying to them this morning? Well, you know, they weren't there. Um, I went through such a roller coaster of uh, emotions yesterday. Um, to have people say that, I think, is extremely uh, pathetic. Um, we were holding on to every second, you know, every, every second, just hoping that uh, he was going to come on. Okay. And, um, I mean, I'm not selling anything. This is what we do all of the time. We've made out uh, the Heaney family schedule in advance, uh, you know, a year in advance, what we're going to do, where we're going to do it. And um, I'm not selling anything. You know, I don't have a can of beans I'm trying to promote. So uh, this is just another day in the life of what we do. What was the last thing you said to Falcon last night when you put him to bed? I said, I love them very much. I love all my boys. These guys are everything, you know? Um, we're a pretty tight family. And Falky, and, uh, Falky, are, you feel okay now? Falky, are you okay now? And are you, yeah, he, are you gonna go back up in your hiding place ever again? <laughs> you can hear that? Yeah. Did you say no. He says no. All right, well, of course, the most important thing on earth is that everyone is safe and those three boys are safe this morning. Thank you again so much for being with us. You're, you're welcome. Thank and you. Thank, thank you uh, again for everybody's support. Um, the prayers, and everybody that uh, helped out in the search. Great. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.